I'm Emma reporting from the Prince Charles Cinema here in Leicester Square for the A Love That Never Dies screening. We've been given the chance to talk to acclaimed documentary filmmakers Jimmy Edmonds and Jane Harris. When Josh first died, I didn't want to hear about anybody else's grief. Give me a break. I couldn't have done. I just could not have heard beyond my own pain. So basically our film is a tribute to our son who died and in the wrong order of things. Nobody expects that their child will die before them. And we wanted to honour his life and his death by saying to people, this happens and don't be afraid of grief and death and what it represents. We want people to be able to be more comfortable alongside the bereaved. The thing about losing a child is it has a sort of nightmare quality to it. It's just like a loss of identity and a confusion and just a sense of disbelief. My son Josh is dead. What we represent is something very scary for people. Nobody wants their child to die before them. So we're trying to say it happens and don't fear it, just be with it. The first time I laughed, I thought what a horrible person I was to laugh when my child had died. I didn't want to enjoy anything or eat the foods that he liked or do anything because he couldn't do it. My grief is sacred. My love for my son is sacred. And the night Jordan died, we were laying there in bed and she looked at me and she said, Daniel, this is not good for our marriage. Statistically, people who lose children don't stay together. What do you want people to kind of take away from your film? Hope. Hope. The fact that um, if you're grieving for a child, whatever feelings you're having are practically perfectly normal. Everybody grieves in a different way. Uh, a lack of judgment about the way in which somebody is grieving. Um, a sense of life after death. Everybody seemed to struggle with this same question of how to fit in. And I kept thinking, isn't this mad? We're bereaved parents and yet we're desperately trying to fit in. You have to come to grips with your helplessness around it. No one can take it away. You can't bypass it. It's really important to us that the bereaved aren't seen as different. Many people are bereaved through loss of relationship, through loss of home or house. Um, bereavement covers so many different categories. Um, it's wider than we would ever imagine. So let's just sort of respect people who have had losses and not, not fear that loss. This documentary truly represents how people should really talk about grief. And through a creative process, these parents are able to show their handling of losing a child. I've been Emma, reporting from the Prince Charles Cinema in Leicester Square. Thank you for watching.